Sector is clear. Give us everything we got! I'm All wings! Welcome back to Ant Lives The Channel. It is February 20th, 3.38 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you are new to the channel. And as I always say, I got your back. New subscribers, you're going to come to find out that I got your back. And to the channel gang, you guys know I got your back. Thank you so much for your support. This right here marks my 200th and 94th build for NBA 2K22 current gen. I am the old head goat builder. I am the best builder in the world and I am the hardest working builder for NBA 2K22 current gen. And 294 builds only prove that fact. This is LeBron James first ever <laughs> facilitating finisher exact build and you're only going to find it here at Ant Lives The Channel. YouTube first. That's two in two days. All right. So now what we're going to do with the skill breakdown. I got to pat myself on the back with that one. That's two in two days. YouTube first. LeBron James. Okay. Now this is his real exact facilitating finisher build. We're going to go right here with the skill breakdown of half playmaking, half finishing, one eighth defense, and one eighth shooting pie chart for the skill breakdown. Now we're going to go right here with the fifth pie chart. Alright. Now. We're going to bring his close shot to 87. We're going to bring his driving layup to 80. We're going to bring his driving dunk to 83. And we're going to bring his standing dunk to 81. And then we're going to bring. To 66. Let me make sure that. All right, yes, we're going to bring that 66. Now, nothing on his shooting. He is a peer facilitating finisher. All right, we're going to go up to 83 on his um, pass accuracy, all the way up on his ball handle, then on his post control. We're going to go all the way up as well, and that's going to give him 30 playmaking badges. Now, we're going to go all the way up on his interior defense. We're going to go all the way up on his perimeter defense. We're going to go all the way up on his lateral Quickness, we're going to go all the way up on his steal. We're going to go all the way up on his block. All right, now, nothing on his offensive rebound, and we're going to put the rest on his defensive rebound. So, you already know we got the 10, of course, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about the slasher takeover. That's what I'm referring to as the 10, because it is the most powerful badge on this game, and it gives... A 10 to your physicals, a 10 to your finishing, a 5 to your shooting, a 10 to your, pa your ball handle, a 5 to your pass accuracy, a 5 to your post control, and a 5 to your defensive rebounding. Now, let's go further in this build. Now, we're going to keep him at, no, we're going to make him defined. All right, matter of fact, we're going to make him burly, okay? We're going to make him burly. Now, we're going to keep him at 6'7". I'm making him burly for me. Now, it's something I want to tell you guys, right? You can go here all the way to 189 and get this exact build for LeBron James. All right, so I'm going to go with 189. That's right, only I analyze the channel. Now, for his wingspan, I'm going to go all the way to 89.0 for his wingspan. Now, like I said before, with the with the slash of takeover when you ignite it, but when so like I said before, once you ignite it at 99 overall, you see the physicals on the build, you see the finishing, you see the playmaking, and you see the defense and rebounding. So you already can get an assumption in your head where things are going to be. So at 99 overall, you're going to have a close shot of 94 when you ignite the slash of takeover, and when you ignite it, that will be a close shot that goes over the cap of 99 and will be 104 that's nice i had to get that right like wow okay yes that's very nice now your driving layup will be at 86 and 90 overall and when you're like the size to take over that's going to be a 96 now your driving dunk will be a 90 and 90 overall you will be able to get pro contact dunks 
as well as elite alley oop content. I mean, elite alley oop dunks and pro dunks. I mean, and pro alley oop dunks. But when you like decide to take over 99 raw, your driving dunk will go over the cap of 99 and will be 100. Your standing dunk will be a 97 and 99 overall. And when you like decides to take over a 99 overall, that will go over the cap of 99 and be a 107. Now, your post hook will be a 72 at 99 overall. And when your knight decides to take over at 99 overall, that will be a 82. So he's got a nice arsenal inside of the low post, low block area. He can do a, a multitude of things. All right. Now, your, play, your playmaking. You're going to have a pass accuracy of 87 at 99 overall. And when your knight decides to take over, that will be a 92. Now look at your ball handling because you're going to be able to speed boost well before you get to 99 overall. As soon as you get a 70 um, ball handle and you have an 80 speed, you're going to be able to uh, speed boost as soon as your knight decides to take over. But at 99 overall, you're going to be a dribble guy because you're going to have an 82 ball handle at 99 overall. So you are going to be able to get all of LeBron James, LeBron James' signature uh, dribble combinations. But at 99 overall, when your knight decides to take over, that will be a 92. Whew. So, yes, this is LeBron James. This is a triple-double threat. Now, it's LeBron James that has to be considered a triple-double threat. Now, your post control will be a 86 and 99 overall. And when you and Knight decides to take over, that's going to be a 91. Now, you will have a little bit of an interior defense because you're going to have a 59 interior defense and 99 overall. And when your Knight decides to take over, that's going to be, excuse me, y'all, that's going to be a 64. Now, your perimeter defense will be a 78 at 99 overall. And when you like decides to take over, that will be a 83. And then you're going to have a lot of quickness of 76. And when you like decides to take over, that's going to be an 81. And then you're going to have a still of 78. And when you like decides to take over, that's going to be an 83. And then you're going to have a block. So you're going to have a block. You're going to be able to block shots with this build as well. But you will have a block of 69 and 99 overall. And when you like decides to take over, that's going to be a 74. Now, your defense rebound will be a 76 and 99 overall. And when you like decides to take over, that will be a 81. Now, here goes the great part about the build. Now, remember, like I said, you can go all the way from 189 all the way up to 260. But I'm going with 189 because I want the speed out of this building. It is LeBron James. So the game is going to recognize it as LeBron James. So you're going to get characteristics of this uh, build of LeBron James. Now, a 99 overall, and before then, it's four ways we get the fours, and that is the Gatorade facility, level 40, winning the NBA championship, and getting to 99 overall, as we all know. So, a 99 overall, you're going to have a speed and an acceleration, but your speed will be a 90, and your acceleration will be a 88. And when your night decides to take over a 99 overall, you're going to have a speed that goes over the cap of 99 and will be 100, and then you're going to have an acceleration of 98. He is super fast. Boy, 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 with those playmaking badges. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Boy. And then you're going to have a vertical of 89 and 99 overall. And when you're like the size of ticket, well, that will be a 99. Now, you're going to have a strength of 64, which is good for a small four. And when you're like the size of ticket, 99 overall, that will be a 74. Now, like I said before, you can do this from the seat of your chair, and it hurts your physicals, right? You can do this when you see your chair as well. This you cannot do, and this is what's going to truly bring out the LeBron James in this build. Mm, the slash of takeover. And there you have it. Facilitating finishing only at Ant Lives The Channel. LeBron James's first ever facilitating finisher exact build, and you're only going to find it here at Ant Lives The Channel. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. This is build number 294. Now, I'm going to test this build. And what I mean by that, I'm just going to show you guys where I placed the badges if I was to use this build. Man, yes, he is nice. You know, like, like I tell people, I have a multitude of LeBron James builds, exact builds. Some can shoot. Some can defend and shoot. Some can sh shoot, finish, Hall of Fame. Some with Hall of Fame finishing, Hall of Fame shooting badges. Um, you know, trust me, I have a multitude of LeBron James builds. You guys are more than welcome to check those out. Now I'm just going to go 
we got a standing dunk here, so we're gonna have to sacrifice. Well, no, we can't. We, we're small, so we're not gonna sacrifice too much on Giant Slayer. But then we're gonna go right here with Fast Twitch. We can go with Fast Twitch, or better yet, for me, I'm gonna take Slurry Finisher because when he goes to the hole, he is kind of small in size. So I want him to be able to get some type of separation. All right. Now, I want it. I'm gonna go with Clutch Shooter. I got 30 playmaking badges. Of course, no, 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 no. Yeah, we're gonna go triple threat juke silver. Unpluckable. Quick chain. Quick first step. Hyper drive. Handles for days. Downhill. And tight handles. And that tight handles also is gonna help out the uh the silver slithery finisher a whole lot as well. All right, these cop, these badges right here on this build, I don't know what anybody's gonna do with you. you like I said, you can bring this build from 189 all the way to 260, 265, I mean. So, yeah, I'm bringing him into my build. I just wanna see what he does. Now I got eight defensive badges, right? So I gotta have that chase down. Okay, as a matter of fact, I'm gonna go with rebound chaser. Right, and I got one more, and I'm gonna get that chase down LeBron James effect with that gold intimidator. I'm gonna get that because I have that vertical. I'm not really worried about rim protector because intimidator and chase down is our rim protectors without it actually being there. It just makes it maybe show up a little bit more. But like I said, I'm gonna go with rebound chaser so I can get those rebounds and push the fast break. And there you have it. Only an Ant Lives Dutch Channel. Now do we have the first ever exact LeBron James build facilitating finishing. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell if you are new to the channel. As I always say, I got your back. The channel gang, you guys already know I got your back. This is build number 294 for y'all. I am the old head gold builder. I am the best builder in the world, and I am the hardest working builder for NBA 2K22 current gen. And 294 builds only prove that fact. And without anything further being said, I'm